what's going on guys, what's up 223, I'm just making a quick video right here, what I am actually doing is I am corrosion X and conformal coating my lid torn, um, I have a couple of others I want to try waterproofing like my uh, tweaker 180 right here, or my Martin 220, those are my two daily flyers, but I've never waterproofed before, so I kind of want to try it on a cheaper build before I try it on something more expensive, obviously. So, I've watched quite a few people do this, and from what I've seen, conformal coating, which I have right here, uh, pretty much covers the ESCs, which this is the 4-in-1 on the blade torrent, it covers the flight controller, front and back of the camera, but not the lens, the transmitter, and the receiver. What doesn't um, get done basically with the conformal coating is anything with the camera lens, and also the corrosion X is for all the connections like these, the pins, the inside, the outside right there, um, and then on, obviously on all these uh, flight controllers and everything, you want to get all these pins and your, your USB pin, you want to do all that with the uh, Corrosion X, so that way nothing rusts up or anything in the rain or in the snow, whatever you plan on flying in. But I actually uh, broke an antenna today. I kind of don't like these uh, antennas because I broke one. But basically, I've already hit this with the first coat. I've got my little black light right here so I can actually see what's been done and what glows. So you can tell you know, if there's any spots you really got to go over again, you'll kind of see that they'll turn. It'll be kind of like a, like a darker color, like a blackish color. Like, obviously, you can see around the corners, around the corners of the ESC, where it doesn't actually glow. You can tell right there, so that's where you can tell you need to go over again. I'm going to hit everything with a second coat anyway, so but I figured I'd show you guys pretty much where I'm at. I went and did the entire camera and all around the lens and pretty much anywhere you can kind of think of is what you want to do. So I'll hit this for the second coat and I guess we'll see within the next few weeks if I get a rain flight. Alright, so in the end I wound up doing about three coats of the uh, conformal coating and I wound up doing about right now the three coats of the corrosion X on all the connectors, plugs, USB ports, uh, everything like that. Um, a couple reasons I went so crazy with this um, was because I wanted to make sure that I did not run into any issues anywhere along the line. This being my my first waterproof, and I want to guarantee a hundred percent that uh, I could pretty much sink this thing, and I'd be totally fine. So I guess we'll find out. I'm gonna let this sit for a few hours. That way, everything can settle. I even went all through my batteries, everything. And come morning time, I'll slap this together. Just to be funny, it probably won't rain for like another month or so now, but I guess we'll see what happens, and we'll see if she flies in the rain. Thanks, guys. What's up, guys? Quick update on my blade torrent. <clears throat> so the reason you see it all put back together like this is because I fixed it. Um, my previous video, I sit there and I, uh, I hit the magic button, start everything from scratch, that fixed <clears throat> most of my problems, excuse me, most of my problems, but uh, I still had a motor sputtering, so 
I actually switched a couple of motors around, tried it out again, and just to make sure it wasn't the ESC or anything, and I actually fixed it. I figured out what motor it was. I had to order one, wait for it, just came in, put it on, got everything running. Now, one more quick update before I end this video. If you can see right here, I have this pretty much set up right now as a... As a multi-rotor. Now, in the manual, it tells you to set it up as an airplane. Um, I don't know why they tell you to do this, because I never got the... The telemetry to work. Uh, having it set up as airplane, I tried like so many different ways, tried to get it to work, and nothing ever seemed to really work. But... After I went through and I set everything up and... Look at that. Telemetry reading right now. So, I mean, as you can see, it definitely, uh, definitely fixed. <laughs> Yeah.